Hello and welcome to today's episode of Rusty Duck Garage. Today we have a very unusual truck, a 2024 Chevrolet Silverado EV, all electric work truck, or what I believe to be a work truck. Now, as you can see in the photos here, that this truck was damaged in an accident and it's at a public auction. All right, guys, here we got a rare one the 2024 Silverado EV all electric. Can't get this truck and it is selling this morning actually it just sold this morning here at the auction see it's punched in the front which really shouldn't hurt the battery or any electronics at all what a truck 450 mile range i went to the auction this morning with plans to buy this truck because i thought it would make great content because these trucks are not available to the public yet very very rare to see one uh, out in testing or on loan to uh, YouTubers and various fleets. I believe this truck was uh, either owned or loaned to a fleet that was doing some testing, a large fleet. I do, the, do know the name of the fleet. And apparently they'd gotten into an accident with this truck. And it went through the auction a few minutes after I arrived. I didn't get a chance to bid on the truck because I was just a little bit late, not realizing it would sell nearly that early in the morning. The truck for sold for less than $35,000. I think this was a great buy. I'm not sure what the retail price will be, but I understand the work truck may start at $75,000, although I have heard reports of them being even cheaper. Now this truck here has a 10,000 pound towing capacity and 1300 pound payload however in some early testing these trucks are easily capable of towing 10,000 pounds and getting a range of about 250 miles while towing that's pretty good uh, empty these trucks have no problem reaching 450 miles so this is really kind of the first ev truck in my opinion that would work similar to your gasoline powered half ton truck. I looked this damage truck over pretty carefully underneath and could not see any damage near the battery. There was a cooler up front and maybe the AC condenser that was damaged. And one of the rig, real big issues with this truck being it's not available to the public yet is parts. And I knew that I was be taking a big risk in trying to find parts for this truck. I have a late model 21 Toyota Highlander right now that I'm working on that have been waiting months on parts. So parts on some of these new vehicles currently are very difficult to get. And I'm sure that would be the case with this. So maybe it's better that I didn't get the truck. But I do think that the Silverado EV is an interesting truck uh, with a 450 mile range is pretty impressive. Uh, but it doesn't have the bed space, in my opinion, for, to, to work like a conventional half-ton truck for use uh, for contractors, etc. and stuff. But it is coming along the way. The other issue is the charging time. It is going to take a long time to charge these trucks. But this is much better, mm -hmm. in my opinion, than a Rivion or something like that. Well, I hope you like today's video, and we'll catch you next time at Rusty Duck Garage.